What a complete performance by the Yukon Huskies. You could pick uh, several areas on the floor to look at, and you can know that Yukon dominated. I'm going to take this first spot and say offensive rebounding as Yukon crashed the glass early, and it wasn't just the front line. It was all five guys. That was one of the biggest things. You know, they have guards that can rebound the ball very well, um, but, you know, we have five guys that can that will always, like, attack the glass on both ends of the floor. So, you know, it was just important for us to win that, you know, battle on the boards, um, have low turnovers. We pride ourselves on, uh, on rebounding in general. Uh, we knew they were a really aggressive rebounding team, but we wanted to punk them. They tried to punk us on the boards, but we wanted, we, wanted, we ain't going to let that happen. Uh, we want to attack the glass how we always do. What in your mind went so well, and when did you know things were going to go well? Um, it was defensive end. We started off aggressive on defense, and we threw the first punch. So uh, when we're aggressive like that, I feel like it's hard to beat us. So we felt good going to halftime, but just couldn't let ourselves get comfortable with that lead. And um, obviously came out in the second half. We had a couple bad stretches, but um, ultimately kept it going down the, uh, down the road and, uh, you know, finished the deal. It's really hard to find fault with the Huskies' performance tonight. It wasn't perfect, but darn close. Can they play this way on Saturday? Might they need to play even a little bit better? Well, time will tell, and it's the Elite Eight on Saturday for a right to go to the Final Four. At the NCAA Sweet 16 in Las Vegas, Mark Robbins, Channel 3, I went to sports. Thanks, Mark. Get some rust, my man. And look, it's the first time the Huskies have gone this far since 2014, and we know what happened. If you don't, you better ask somebody. A lot of action tomorrow. The UConn women are in Seattle for the Sweet 16. Joe Zones with them. And Quinnipiac men's hockey starts its march to the Frozen Four in Bridgeport against Merrimack. I'm Unqua Sonia. That's sports tonight, folks. I, this morning, my yeah, man. That'll work. Hey, that'll work. Got a Happy busy few days coming up, though. <sighs> and so does everybody else. <laughs> Thank you very much for joining us tonight. Yeah.